Hey y'all, welcome back to the kitchen for another episode of What's Cooking with the Bear. Today, we're going to do pierogies and Polish kielbasa. Awesome dish, one of my favorites. Haven't had it in a really, really long time, so I decided I'd go ahead and cook it up for you. So, here we go, let's get to cooking. All right, y'all. To get our meal started here, I got some water on here getting ready to boil because I'm going to boil my pierogies before I fry them. Uh, I think they turn out a lot better that way. Personal preference, you cook them however you want. But we're also going to start by caramelizing some onions. I got me a little butter in the pan here. And you can find here in the background, I got my air fryer going. That's how I'm cooking my kielbasa. So... Uh, I'm gonna get this butter melted here. We're gonna add just a little bit of garlic to it because you know Try it You know you may like it. I like the Caramelized garlic or caramelized onion with a little bit of garlic in it. So All right, I'm gonna go ahead and get these started caramelizing up let that water get boiling and uh once we get uh, that stuff going, we'll bring y'all back. All right, y'all. Here's the uh, pierogies we're going to use. They're Mrs. T's, loaded baked potato. Uh, I really like these things. We got our water boiling back here, so uh, we're going to put these out. We're going to put about uh, six of them in there at a time. Just boil them for, well, bring it back to a boil. And then about three minutes after that, uh, the uh, they'll be done. Our onions are almost done here. The garlic's browning up really nicely. So, all right. So, all right, let me get this uh, finished up here, and we'll bring you back when we start frying them our pierogies. All right, y'all, our first batch of the pierogies are cooked. We're going to put them off into a little side dish here to drain. Because you don't want all that water going into your hot grease, because we're going to fry them in some hot butter. So. All right. You notice I moved over to my bigger bigger uh, burner just helps it cook a little faster Ooh, I got a bonus it's only supposed to be 12 of them in there so all right let's get these uh, cooked up and then we'll uh, start frying Alright y'all, got our butter all heated back up there, we're going to take these, lay them down in there, alright. Now we're going to get those browned up. We're going to get these other ones out of our hot water. Let them drain off a little bit. Check these and see how they're doing. Ooh, that's fairly nice. Fairly nice. Oh yeah. Now you can cook them to your liking. I just want them slightly browned. So, all right, 
I'm going to go ahead and finish cooking these ones up and cook those up. And when we're ready to do the old tasty test, we'll bring you back. All right, y'all. Let's get this plated up. Make it look all nice and pretty for y'all. So. We got some uh, cheddar cheese to throw on top there. Alright. Get our sausage over here. a little bit of cheese on top of there just a little bit we're gonna do a little dollop of sour cream on the side over here for dipping so all right y'all let's get the uh, camera turned around and uh, we'll do our taste test All right, y'all, time for the taste test. We got our pierogi and a little kielbasa there and some cheese and dipped in a little sour cream, so. Mmm. Delicious, y'all. Absolutely, absolutely delicious. I've missed that. Really good stuff, so. There you have it. My version or my take on Polish kielbasa and uh, pierogies. Add a little cheese on top, a little sour cream on the side, and you got one heck of a meal. So, hope you all enjoyed it. Hope you're gonna try it, and uh, hopefully it made it hung. Hope you hopefully it made y'all hungry. I can talk today. So, anyways, thank you all for watching. Appreciate it. Like, comment, subscribe, and uh, as always. Bear appetit.